Hello, everyone. I know you ain't seen me. I want to say about a week. You know, just trying to get some things together. And I've been a little tired lately. So, you know, I said I'm going to get back to y'all. But today I want to talk about something that maybe you're going through. I know I went through it. And still occasionally I, you know, I go through it. Mood swings. Okay. And it's all related to the the MS. It is. And just know they call it MS for a reason. Because you're dealing with multiple multiple issues so don't cry about it it is what it is I learned to accept it but I remember I started noticing it you know with the mood swings you know I have my bad days where I'm just mad don't even know why I'm mad And then some days I'll be happy. You know, just happy. Meaning like nothing can bother my mood. You know? But the mean person, I don't like it. Because you know, a lot of times you you mad at the wrong person over the smallest things. And that's not cool. And just know, you know, we don't, or I, you know, I don't do it on purpose. It's just psychological. You know? And I don't want nobody to go through that. Because when you're when you're going through something like that and you you know, you're having a a mad, bad day, you start to ask yourself questions like what I'm here for. I'm up here disrespecting my wife, not cussing, just mad. You know, I used to get mad with my kids. She used to tap me on my shoulder. Cool out. I know when she started talking that, I know why she's saying, you know, but I wouldn't beat them or anything like that. And just my attitude, anything can push me to that level of maybe just raising my voice. And I'm not the type to raise my voice. So for something like that, yeah, I need to pump the brakes a little bit. And my babies. Or just people in general. You know? People used to get me so mad. To, to the point where I had to put myself in time out. It's not when your kids acting bad, go to time out. <laughs> like two minutes or something like that, you know, so you can think about what you're doing and why are you being this way? You know, my good days. No issues, because I'm happy. You know? There's nothing like watching sports and your team is losing. You get mad fast. Start saying stuff like, 
man, I wish I could talk to the coach. <laughs> Is he mad? Especially going through them days. Oh, my goodness. Mad. My wife would come in and be like, you need something to drink? Yeah, I, yeah, I, I could take something to drink. And I guess what she was trying to say is drink this and cool off, <laughs> you know? But that's cool. That's cool. And what I always tell people to do, make sure you talk to your doctor. Always, anything you're going through concerning this multiple sclerosis, talk to him or her about anything you're going through because they can help you. I didn't need anger management or anything like that. It wasn't every day. You know? But these days I'm doing much better because I think I'm doing everything I'm supposed to do, you know? And if not, you know, I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out. But you're not alone with this, you know? I talk about the different issues. You know, you may have went through or some of these things or all of these things I'm talking about. You know, or you just don't know why you're going through. You know, if you're not seeing a doctor or you don't want to see a doctor, Maybe you can shoot me a comment, you know, and I would do my best to answer it. But for those that want to follow me and things like that, subscribe to my page and um, make sure you hit that little bell for the notifications and things like that. But I'm about to go to sleep. So y'all be good. I take care.